hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome to today's video so today we have another unboxing um, and this one's a fragile on it but it is a little bit squished um, but this is from craft ease i'm very excited the company reached out asked me if i wanted to become an affiliate with them and try a painting so um, I did buy this painting um, but I am an affiliate with them so I will leave the link down in the description box below um, for their website it is an affiliate link so if you do happen to purchase anything from there it would mean a lot if you were able to use that link that's in the description box below as I would earn a very very small commission on that order having said that if you like what you see and you want to just take a look yourself you can always just type that into google but without further ado let's get on and actually look at what we have so it has one a lot of packaging um which i don't think is coming out so let's just try and open it again and oh let's do it that way <laughs> like when you fail at the first hurdle getting it out of the packaging is like a serious issue okay <laughs> so we are in okay so the first thing i am noticing is this is a very nice obviously a bit squished but branded craft ease box so it says Diamond Art Kit, it says how is Craft Ease different? We actively promote independent artists and collaborate with them by remunerating them for their hard work and inspiring art. So in other words, they license artwork and will pay artists basically for all their paintings that have been purchased. So it tells us what's in it but we'll have a look at that ourselves and it says we with each order you place you support an artist which I think is fabulous and um, you know they're very very much um, a company that wants to support artists so here is their website but let's get into it and have a look what we've got in our little squished box. Okay, so it's just in like a packaging, there's nothing else that is in the box. And then, where is the opening? Oh, it's this side. This side is where we open the painting. Let's get it out. So it comes in a clear sleeve. And then, There's our toolkit and there is our drills, which we will look at in a sec. Oh, we can look at the toolkit now. So we've got two pens, one with like a two placer and one with, I want to say six. We've got a pair of just normal tweezers, a boat, two light blue squishies and two plates of wax. And then this is the painting that I bought. Oh, that canvas feels quite, quite soft, quite nice on the back actually. It's not, it's not like you really soft, fluffy back, but it is. It's a nice feeling canvas. So I don't know if you can see very well, but this is the diamond painting that I got. This is called Portrait of Portia, and it is there. I forget who it's licensed by. It might tell us on the bottom. But are you ready? It is a 40 by 50. And this is the image. I forget who it is licensed by, to be honest. But let's just back it up. Beep, beep. Okay. So this is, let me just see if I can just tilt the camera a bit ever so slightly it's a 40 by 50 it's a true 40 by 50 and it's just this really wonderful african woman with like 
all these different colours. I just thought it was super cool. I really liked it. Let's just see the tackiness. It is very sticky. I'm automatically seeing some love heart symbols and some different symbols. So let's just have a look on the legend. So we've got an M, M, we've got some swirls, a moon, a percentage sign, hashtag, love it. Some weird ones as well, and it does have your DMC numbers. Okay, we have some that's like 4, 15, 1, 7, 2. I wonder if they are A, Bs. But if we just look at the drill field, everything looks super clear. They do have small training wheels around the drills. So what I mean by that, let me just pop it down and zoom you in so I can point. That would definitely be easier. See if it focuses. Just takes a minute. Hello. Let me zoom out slightly so it can focus. There we go, just that slightly. So basically, can you see on these round, there's a little circle around the drills. That's what we call a training wheel and it helps you guide because this is a round painting. It helps you guide where you are putting your drill so they end up being a lot straighter and some people like them some people don't some people find that obviously if you're not going to place it bang on you can sometimes see the dark shade behind the backing so you do have to be a bit more particular where you place them on most colors it doesn't really matter and if i look the only one that it really matters about is um if we just go over here um to where we can see like these white ones they have a black outline now that is the only ones that do kind of make a difference because that is a white area that is where you would place white drills so obviously they're light colored drills and you've got like dark black backing so Usually, I just don't multi-place on them areas, but let's just zoom you out. Oh, wrong way. All the way out. And let's have a little gander at these drills. So, how many colours did we say? 20, 28 colours in this painting. So, a decent amount. And it looks like these packets are in canvas order so they start with like number one so they are in dmc order as well because or are they no they are so they are in dmc order and then obviously you've got your 11 13 and 23 like mixed in but the rest of them go in dmc order so we've got these blues um number three is that 310 yeah, number three is 310. So we've got two packets of 310. Uh, some reds and greys, a bit of yellow. Oh, wow. So, number 11, which is the number four. You probably saw my head. I apologise. Uh, they are crystal rhinestones. So we will look where they go. And then number 13 are also crystal rhinestones and we have two packets of them wow i wonder where they do go on this maybe in her eyes i want to feel i want to say that they might go in their eyes but there are a lot of the orange so maybe in like the sunset sort of thing um and then we've got these colors oh they're all crystal rhinestones i can see the other one so we've got some more orange and blue and then 23 is also a blue crystal rhinestone so no a b's in this book crystal rhinestones instead so let's have a look what the symbols are and then try and find them on the canvas so we are looking for so 11 is an x so they are here some underneath in her eye here some down here some over here so all in these like red sections so i bet you they're all scattered about because this painting is literally like greys oranges reds and blues and we've got a red an orange and a blue 
So orange is D, so I can see some over here in this. Some at the top is there some the yeah, inner eye, they are blues. Um some down here and then sorry not blues, yeah, oranges, and then the like U-turn arrow which you've got all over here. You've got some up here and here. Got some in the blue, some at the top. So we've just got scatterings of these like crystal rhinestones. I think this will look pretty cool. And with it being a little 40 by 50, it'll be super quick to work up. Anyway, so that is my craft ease kit. I will leave a link to this kit in the description box below. Like I said, it will be an affiliate link. I will also leave a link to Craft Ease's website. They also do, I believe, paint by numbers. So you do have to just go on diamond painting if you are wanting a diamond painting because some are only in paint by numbers and some are only in diamond paintings. So don't get a mix up because I did see a few paint by number kits that I really like but I'm not a painter. <laughs> but anyway, if you are a painter, really, really good. So please do go and check out Crafties and like I said, I would really appreciate if you were able to use the affiliate link if you did want to buy anything. So thank you so much for liking, subscribing, commenting and of course watching and until next time guys, see you in the next one.